What's up guys, my name is Devin, also known as FBE, and welcome back to another episode of Footballers. In today's video, we're going to be bringing you guys another episode of the What Players Run the Field series, and today's athlete is going to be Packers corner, Jair Alexander. Before we get into the video, drop a comment on who you guys want to see featured in the next episode. Just in case you guys are new to this channel or just need a quick refresher about what we do in these videos, we take a player for this episode, it's going to be Alexander, we talk about their gear, head to toe, helmets, cleats, shoulder pads, you name it, we're going to talk about it in today's video. I'm going to try and tell you guys everything I know about the product. I'll tell you guys what the product is, why they wear it, what colorways they wear it in, and where you guys can buy it for yourself. Without further ado, let's get into the video and we're going to kick things off at the top, which means it's time to talk about Jair Alexander's helmet. All season long, Jair Alexander has been in the Riddell Speedflex. He's been in the flex since his days at Louisville, and it honestly looks pretty good on him. The flex is one of the best helmets on the market and scores a perfect 5 out of 5 on the Virginia Tech helmet rating scale. It's comfortable, and its modern styling makes it one of the best-looking helmets in football. If you guys want to get one for yourself, Green Gridiron has them for 500 bucks. The next piece of this helmet setup that we're going to talk about is the face mask. On his flex, Jair uses the SF-2BD-SW face mask. This is probably the most basic helmet for this face mask and one of the standard options from Riddell. This mask has no extra bars, no extra anything, just a regular lower and an open top hat. This gives Jair maximum visibility so he can pick the ball off and run the other way. If you guys want to get this mask, Green Gridiron has them for 110 bucks. Also, just something to keep in mind as you guys watch this video, every single product we talk about will be linked in the description below so you guys can directly shop Jair Alexander's locker right there and it also helps out the channel. Next thing we're going to talk about is visors. Every single game this season, Jair Alexander has been wearing an Oakley Pro visor in clear. The Oakley Pro visor is made specifically to fit the curvature of the Speedflex face mask perfectly. A visor is a great way to get some added eye protection and also looks pretty cool. He also uses Oakley quick release visor clips to secure the visor to the face mask. If you guys want to get this exact visor, Green Gridiron has them for $72. Next thing we're going to talk about is the chin strap. Jair Alexander has been rolling with the Sports Star Victory T-Rex Hurricane chin strap. Sports Star makes some of the best chin straps in the game and they are proven to absorb more contact than any other brand out there. These chin straps are made from a soft medical grade foam and are actually proven scientifically to absorb more contact than any other chin strap on the market. Maybe he should tell his buddy Aaron Rodgers to get one for himself. These chin straps also do a great job helping prevent that awful football chin acne. They usually come in this white, unbranded, super clean colorway, and you guys can get them from Green Good Iron for 32 bucks. Next thing we're gonna talk about is a minor accessory, but still important, and that's gonna be the mouth guard. This season, Jair Alexander has been rocking a Vedex lip guard mouth guard. He's worn them in two colorways, black and white. We've talked about Vedex a bunch in these series, and they're honestly a great option for any player at any level. They're inexpensive, they're comfortable, and they come in a million different colorways. You guys can usually get them off Amazon for about 10 bucks. Next thing we're gonna talk about is the shoulder pad. Since he arrived in Green Bay, Jair Alexander has been wearing a Douglas shoulder pad. Pads. Now, most NFL teams don't usually have their players rock a certain brand of gear, but the Green Bay Packers seem to have a close relationship with Douglas. Over the years, we've seen most Packers players in Douglas shoulder pads, and Jair is in them as well. These pads have a white shell with yellow padding underneath, and Douglas has been in the shoulder pad game for over 35 years and makes some of the best on the market. These pads are pretty lightweight, and they don't restrict the mobility of the players, and these allow Jair to run with wide receivers and then adapt to the football and pick it off. If you guys want to check out Douglas shoulder pads for yourself, we will have a link below, and you guys can check out all their different options. The next thing we're going to talk about is what's under those shoulder pads and that's going to be his nike long sleeve undershirt this baggy long sleeve look has quickly turned into one of the most popular looks in football and this yellow that jair is wearing makes it so memorable this segues us perfectly into the sponsor of today's video, us, footballers. Doing these What Players Run the Field videos, we quickly realized that you guys, the general public, do not have the same access to all the cool stuff the players wear, and these long sleeve undershirts are a perfect example. We decided to help you guys out and sell these long sleeve undershirts ourselves. Now for now, you cannot get yellow, but you can get them in white or black, and you guys can add some really cool customization options on the sleeve. You guys can add your name, number, or IG handle. These Nike blanks are extremely expensive for us to buy, but we're trying to keep them at an affordable price for you guys, so you guys can swag out like the pros. If you guys want to get one, head over to footballers.itemorder.com or click the first link in the description below. Next thing we're going to talk about is gloves. This season, Jair has been in the latest receiver glove from Adidas, the Adidas Addy Zero 12.0. He's worn them in a couple different colorways, but he mostly just rocks the black and white colorway. Black accessories have been on the rise in the NFL, but Jair has been doing it for a couple years now. Like I mentioned, the Adidas Addy Zero 12.0 is the latest glove from Adidas and also one of my favorite gloves from this season. These gloves are super duper comfortable. They're really lightweight and the Grip Tech palms are actually pretty sticky. If you guys want more info on these, we do have a full review video, so go check it out. Next thing we're going to talk about is a very unique accessory. When Jair isn't wearing his yellow long sleeve, he pulls out these really unique vintage NFL sweatbands. The first pair is yellow with some really old school Packers branding. I think these might be something the Packers equipment staff found in a corner, covered in dust, and Jair said, let me get those. Those are pretty cool. 
It's honestly a really unique look and it's nice to see something a little bit different from the usual arm sleeves or turf tape. Then he actually wore a second pair and this one was white with the gold NFL shield. And again, just a nice unique accessory you don't really see every day. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to find any of these exact sweatpants on the internet, but I did leave a link to eBay so you guys can check there and see if you can find some. We finally made it all the way down to the bottom, which means it's time to talk about the cleats. For the last couple seasons, Jay Alexander has been incredibly loyal to the Adidas Adi Zero 7.0s. These 7.0s dropped all the way back in 2018 and we rarely see anybody still wearing them. They are some of the lightest cleats of all time, and I'm assuming that's why Jair likes them so much. He's worn them in a couple really cool colorways, all custom painted by the very talented artist at arts underscore undefined. The pair he wears usually all the time is yellow, has his number 23 on the outside, and Ja Money on the inside under the Adidas logo. Now, it might look like he's been wearing the exact same pair every single game, but that's not the case. He had Arts Undefined cook up a whole bunch of pairs, so he always has a fresh one. For their game in London, Jai Alexander wore a different custom pair of cleats. This pair was green and yellow and had a portrait of the late queen. Of course, he wore these to honor the queen. The final pair of customs he wore, he wore on Christmas day. These were obviously Christmas themed and had Rudolph and Santa on the side, candy cane stripes, and ho 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 on the inside. Now if you guys want your own pair of Adidas Adi Zero 7.0s, like I said, they are some of the lightest cleats ever, so they're pretty cool. There's actually a whole bunch on eBay, so we'll link that in the description below for you guys. There you guys have it. There's a full head-to-toe breakdown on Packers Corner, Jai Alexander. Honestly, a lot of really unique stuff. This one was a lot of fun to make. Hope that you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, drop a like, comment who you guys want to see featured in the next episode, and subscribe for more videos just like this one. My name is Devin, also known as FBE, and thank you guys so much for tuning into another episode of Footballers.